Okay guys, what is up? I'm back actually playing Bed Wars for the first time in a while. And I just wanted to play a couple games. Have a somewhat chill video like I sometimes do. Some people like these gameplay videos. Uh, except I'm going to be really rusty. Because guys, the server is so good. So I have not played in, I don't know, like three weeks. Uh, so it's been a minute. So my aim is going to be terrible. I might actually just suck at the game. We'll, uh, we'll see. But what's so cool is uh, I stopped playing because the server was atrocious. This guy might have safe walked. But I came back and it's so good. Let me just kill him out here. I'm using my Model low because this is very late at night and I like to use the Model low for fun when I'm not tryharding. Can I get the bed? Yep. Dang, that guy's knockback is non-existent. But just hang out, use some night skies, play a couple games of Bed Wars. Is he blatantly cheating, dude? You guys saw that VLO, right? Like, is my first rush just blatantly cheating? It's not important, I'm not gonna call this hacker clutch or anything, even if he is cheating, because it's like a super easy win. He kind of freaking sucks. But he safe walks to me, right? Yeah, he safe walked me. And he's using full VLO, so, you know, easy cheater first rush. That guy really sucked. So, as you guys can see, I can't really drag click, because very late at night. But I want to get a little into playing the game again now that I'm finally done with work. So I had taken a slight hiatus from making videos and playing the game because I had been pretty damn busy with work. Now work has ended and I have a couple more weeks left of summer before I go back to school. So I think I'm going to spend a little more time on YouTube making some videos. I want to tell you guys also about my plans for 15k. If and when I get 15k subs. I'm going to do a big sky release. So you guys probably know that I have a lot of custom skies. Like making skies is one of my very favorite things to do now uh, as like a little hobby project. But I don't know which ones to release. So I'm planning to release custom skies for 15k, but I have so many of them that I have no idea which ones to release. So if you guys have been watching my videos and have a favorite sky of yours that you wanna tell me to release, go ahead and do that in the comments. Um, if not, that's fine. I'm going to be showcasing a lot of my night skies in this video. So, if you don't have any favorites yet, you might after this video. Uh, besides all that, I'm just going to be hanging out in some Bed Wars. Every game will have a new sky. Is he still chasing? Cool, I'm not going to fireball jump on purpose so that he still chases me and I can final him. Like, dude, my first hit's so nice now. But yeah, if you guys do have a favorite sky, that you would be interested in me releasing. I cannot release all of them, by the way. And I'm planning, I'm not sure how many I'm gonna release yet, but to be completely honest, I probably have around 80 or 90 custom skies at this point. So, uh, I can probably stand to release a chunk of them for 10K. I mean, for 50K, like maybe 10 skies total or something. Everyone's kinda separated this game. I'll take this final, the quick little backboard, like at that block. Um, get stacked up i uh, don't think we need it but i'm gonna get it but yeah guys don't expect that frequent wednesday videos i do have a lot of other stuff going on preparing for school but i'm really hoping that i can just do some more editing than i have been as of recently get some more videos out really trying to make the push to 15k instead of what the current one is which in all honesty is very poor for the current um, landscape of YouTubers. GG for that first game, except for my first rush cheater. Screw him. Everyone else GG. All right, we are going to get into the second game, and we have a new sky. This is, in my opinion, one of the better ones that I've ever made. You know that I love my ocean skies. This is finally a midnight ocean. We got a big secondary moon, beautiful little cloud pattern at the top, shine on the water. Very, very nice sky. So yeah, this is personally one of my favorite night skies that I made, but I really haven't made that many night skies, so. Oh, that lagged the chunk, but I did kill him. That's pretty laggy. That is going to be scary for bridge fights, so I'll just try to take it as smooth as possible against him. Too 
dude. High ping gets the goofiest KB. At least that means he will not die before he ends up uh, getting his bed mine. Gonna head mid here. Back. That's the rust right there. Blue, interestingly enough, not going for me. He's just gonna dip out in a different direction. We've got pink making what I consider a very odd bridge. He has a final kill, so I'll pretend to head this way. Oh my gosh, dude. I'm so rusty now. I don't know how he made it to my base, but he should be on no health, so... Free kill. There he goes. Oh, he brought me a diamond! My goat? I'm not really that worried about buying a trap ever when it's just one person left. Like, it's not hard to keep track of a single person without the trap anyway. Uh, he probably wants to fireball jump here, but I'm just gonna bite anyway. Beautiful hit. There he goes. See, this is what I mean by the server is so good now, dude. I don't think we need to get any VMs. We're probably just gonna push him. I'm gonna stop the gap. Cool, he's chasing. Just gonna block him off and run. Beautiful little editing, and he DCs. Perfect. Alright, but yeah, very pretty sky, um, very easy game, GG, well played, and now we're into the next game and the next sky, very pretty one from the same batch as the last one that I showed off, to such, like, smooth light from it, really makes the shaders look good, the ground is nice, uh, my first rush is coming, so I'll show it off in a second, oh, cool, he's stupid. I hate that glitch, man. They need to get rid of that, however that works. But now you'll get a decent look at it. Very pretty. Certainly like the vibe of this one. I'm just gonna go up here. I don't think that roof he made is very useful. Pretty sure I'll just be able to get his bed from this. Unless he can hit me through blocks like that. Oh, this guy's a little weird with it. But his roof that he made is going to be his demise. Oh, he left the game. Sweet. Don't need to steal his gen after him. Uh, void time. Oh, well. Sorry to these materials because I forgot to put them away correctly. But yeah, we'll get to show off the sky a little bit. Ooh, long void. Just super pleasant. I will say that the added moon is kind of bright. But you only really get that super bright effect because I play with the shaders that I do. Do I want to trade beds? No, I don't. I'm gonna let him get his two emeralds and fight me. Ooh, no, he ran. Even better. I'll take six plus my prot sharp from diamonds. Aggroing there, you know, I could, but he's pre-gap, and even though I'm... Okay, actually, funny enough, I beat this guy in sumo right when I got on today. Like, you know, four minutes before I started recording, I beat him in sumo, so... But, the six M's plus the prot sharp... It's just too clean. Do not want to be wasting that. Oh no, there's a skibbity on me. Gotta be a little careful. He's on 200 MS, so he's not gonna take knockback. But he did just get melted damage wise. The question now is is the Nick guy gonna double team me from mid while I'm busy here? Not yet, unless he far in this, which would actually be a smart play. What? Dude, he placed blocks through my blocks over and over. I'm just gonna run and kill him. Oh, perfect. That's why you defend your bed, guys. Look at my hit reg. Uh, yeah, whatever, I'm just gonna avoid. Probably not gonna lose my bed for that. Yo, what is he doing? Okay, well, having been in that void, like, area was really nice, because now I know that I can just buy a bridge egg. He won't be expecting anybody to go for his bed because he didn't bridge to diamonds. That's the only reason people do that. So a bridge egg is just going to completely blindside him. I'm going to take the far route at mid here in case that changes whether or not I'm in his render distance so that he can see or not see me. He is actually just back at his base. Three, mm, not worth it. Get across this bridge before he fireballs. Just going to blow up his defense, I think.
beautiful block off. GG. Well played to that guy, but this guy is just too clean. Alright, let me change skies real quick. This last one has a little bit of a different vibe to skies that I made in the past, but I feel like being on gray team is going to complement it perfectly. The clouds are still really clean, and the coloring is uh, like less distracting, just like a really nice background of the sky. This guy is rushing the wrong way, so his bed's going to die. Uh, I guess I have to counter him anyway. And run back. Oh, okay, I'll take your final. Dude, Hypixel needs to fix that. What a beautiful hit. Um, I feel like pushing here is not a good play, but I'm not really paying that much attention. Blocked his fireball. That was most of his materials, so I'm not that worried anymore. Wait, actually, he just let me win this fight when I really shouldn't have been able to. Oh, is he blatant? Is he blatantly cheating? Um, so now... The lucky thing is, he was on zero, so... Even if he comes for me, I should be able to win the fight pretty comfortably, especially if I grab sharp. So I want to play defensive here, don't really gain anything from going in, but if I get sharp at my base, I think I'll be in a great spot. Ooh, and armor. Yeah, this was a good call on my part. White hasn't gone for my bed yet. Uh, if he plays stupid, I just have to let him. Always a little confusing when people play like this because they don't gain anything for it. Yep, he's just going to run. White not coming. The question here is, would skipping him be beneficial? Nah, I'm just gonna kill him, he doesn't even have armor. Plus, I need to see if he's cheating. Nice. I think these five diamonds will be worth a lot long term, instead of throwing them off, if I actually use them to get Prot Trap here, and Feather Falling because it's in rotation. Irritating enough that I can't just like, Oh, I wanted my inventory because it's been so long since I played. I think I'm going to go for Prot 2 because even if I go... Oh, he went mid. Whoops. Yeah, I'm going to kill this kid. Oh, my blocks disappeared. What? I don't know how to judge this guy, man. Make sure we can ladder clutch that. Just kidding. I took fall damage anyways. I'm gonna go for White's bed now. White doesn't have a bed. I need to look at that thing more often. I'll commit to it. Just make sure that my movement is perfect and I think I'm gonna commit to voiding. My movement was about as good as it could be. Yeah, he wasn't even coming back. Uh, looks like he went to white, based on these random blue blocks over here. Yep, there he is. Flick. Dink. Splat. He gone. Dude, his KD is so whack. I guess I have to actually hit him, hit him. Guy over here. I wonder if he has a fireball. He hit me after he died. That was such a nice combo up until that. And now I'm assuming a pretty simple and routine end to the game. Unless I mess it up somehow. He is pretty far away, so it would be nice if I could end it here. Bro, let me up. Do I want to let him go? I don't think so. I think I missed that fireball. Yeah, I did. That's not a good play from him. Wow, play behind Ensign. I think the void here is a little bit obvious. Don't even need to say anything. The reason, guys, that I said that play wasn't very good is that because he fireball jumped, he doesn't have a bridge all the way back to his base now. And yeah, now he's just realizing that. He also doesn't have another fireball. I would fireball him off, but I feel like it's safer to just fireball jump. Yeah. There he goes. GG, GG. That's the darker sky. Also, we're really close to 14k subs. I don't know if we hit it yet or not. I'm just guessing that we didn't. So sub. Even if we did, sub.